Kamala Kluche is our correspondent who is embedded in that campaign trail, will be joining us briefly. But before that, let's listen to what exactly the former president has also been telling electorates on his campaign tour of the Upper East region. And then I am sure that one day, the next time we are seeing you here, you will tell us that when I became president, this is what I did for Nando. You have seen how our roads are. We don't even need to speak. Anandom is one of the few towns in Ghana which has led in education. Some of the greatest educated people, and not forget our beloved Cardinal Derry of Blessed Momero, who brought education, the Catholic education, and it is because of him some of us have enjoyed the, the, the knowledge of schooling. Definitely, Nando people, 92% of us live because of agriculture. I'm happy to say that two years I've been on the throne, going to the third, I noticed that we need support when you come. Because as I said in Wa, the best medicine is food. Give you give nutrients. Even the feeding mothers, the pregnant women. So we would like you to prioritize agriculture. In fact, scientific research has shown that the food that we prepare in Nando, our local foods are very, very nutritious. And that if we, you assist us to process some of these things, or to send them, we will be fed well. And then they said, only a healthy man can be a wealthy man. So, Mr. President, incoming, don't forget Nando. Do all you can to make Nando your home. We shall welcome you anytime you come here. And we shall give you the necessary support you need to become an exceptional head of state. Right, so clearly that's um, you know, Professor Edmond Dele. For those of you who've been following politics in the country, his former uh, general secretary, or national chair, I should say, of the Convention People's Party. So he has endorsed the NDC flag bearer, John Dramani Mahama, saying that he believes if he does come into power, he would help the people uh, in the Damango constituency and surrounding uh, areas. So that's what the NDC flag bearer has been on to.